17.40. Morrow is our winner. Fifty Locker is our winner. Coming in, second closing hard, moving up. Well, on a credible, credibly fast 16.52. Your, teammate, your teammates were hyped, you broke 17. How you feeling? Pretty good. I mean, that surprised me. Um, I was just kind of going in to run with the top girls, see, see what I could do, and came, it ended very well. <laughs> Did you have a big goal for this meet, or was it just...? Um, I just kind of wanted to PR for the season here, um, which my PR previously for this season was 17.43, so I definitely, that was on a harder course, but I definitely beat that. And then I ended up PRing all the time, so that was great. Besides so being a pretty flat course, did you do anything different? How was the race? Um, I just figured it's great practice for CIF prelims and finals at Riverside, so I kind of wanted to focus on racing it like I would there. You know, um, stay with that top group, and then with like 1,200 to go, I was feeling good, so I decided to just go for it and kind of try and make a move. So you're feeling pretty good with your pacing and everything on flat courses? Yeah, it, it went out pretty fast, which I was a little worried about, but I kind of settled a little bit, and once I kind of got into my rhythm, yeah, it was good. What's your league finals course like? Uh, pretty flat, too. So, yeah, so yeah. you pretty much just flat the rest of the season yeah, now? Yeah, until the state meet, yeah. Okay, what are a few things you're going to work on heading into, heading into rest on, on flat courses? Um, I think just trying even, even pacing during, um, during the race, you know, running even. Um, and then I'm definitely going to work on my kick because that's something that I kind of lacked last year in the postseason. I think it's already better this year, but I'm definitely going to work on that speed 